see you. Go, POTUS. It's your birthday. <laughs> Can I? I'm going to open the show quoting a Republican. Oh. Joe Walsh. Okay. Oh, oh geez. Yeah, well. Former Representative Joe Walsh said Biden had the guts to get us out of Afghanistan. He deserves huge credit for ending America's longest war. And Biden was right to say we didn't need to uh, American troops in Afghanistan to kill the terrorists there. He deserves huge credit for this latest terrorist killing. Thank, Thank you. you. I would like an apology on my desk by end of business today from everybody in the media. Get it out. Oh, you didn't see Fox and Friends this morning. No. <laughs> Why would I do that to myself? <laughs> Adam Kinzinger agreed with Joe Walsh. Right. Yes. So it's a good oh thing my, he's not running again. I <laughs> want an apology for every stupid person that was like, oh, we did Beth Kinnison. <laughs> he was, he, right? Mm -hmm. He was absolutely right to get us out of Afghanistan, yes. our longest, stupidest war. And I'm sorry, Iraq was our stupidest war. Another Republican got us into that. Can I just say another thing? Republicans suck at national security. Yes. Let's run on that. 9-11 yes. happened on George Bush's watch yes. despite mm -hmm. massive amounts of intelligence right. warnings. He gets us into Afghanistan, our longest war, and Iraq, our stupidest war, mm -hmm. right? Oh, my God. Obama takes out bin Laden with one bullet in one good eye. Bam, right? <laughs> Bush lets him go at Tora Bora. Obama takes... Yep. Pardon me. I would like to thank you. I am feeling patriotic. I would like to have some America Strikes Back sex with somebody. Anybody. Hello? Anybody. Man, woman, hole in the tree. What? Yes. Oh, somebody oh, in particular. <laughs> do, it, do it with somebody special. Don't just Here's do it with my point. Willy -nilly. Here is my point, Jody Hamilton. <laughs> right? Obama uh, yeah. takes him out with one... Right? Then yeah. Obama gets us out of Iraq, our stupidest war. Yep. And now... Biden, Trump says he'll get us out of Afghanistan, but he didn't because it's another one of his stupid lies. He released 5,000 Taliban. Biden gets us out of our longest war. Yep. And takes out. All first of all, why would you take that number two Al Qaeda job? I'm just I saying. Know, really. I don't right. want to be promoted. I'm good where I am. Right. Thank you. All mm -hmm. cocky Thank you. going into Kabul on his balcony. Yeah. Reminded me of that scene in Hocus Pocus. Yeah. <laughs> Look at what a beautiful day. Uh oh. Bye bye. <laughs> Hellfire. I, I never saw her. I never saw her. Oh, it's Focus. adorable. It's Kathy and Jimmy says, uh oh. Uh -oh. Bye bye. Right before she gets, they get vaporized. They get vaporized? Well, thanks for giving away the oh, ending. Oh, sorry. Spoiler, Spoiler alert. alert. 20 something year old film. Although, the ship, the ship they, sinks in Titanic. Hocus Pocus 2 comes out this fall, <gasps> so. Rosebud's the sled. I knew that. I've seen that. You haven't seen Citizen Kane. The once wife I get did going it. On, once I get going on spoiler alerts, I can't The wife stop. did it. The boat sinks. <laughs> He was a ghost it's the a whole dude. time. He was it's, a ghost the whole, who was dead the whole time. It's a dude in Crying Game. <laughs> the cliff winds and Thelma Louise. Yeah. <laughs> Yay, Susan Sarandon. <laughs> Ooh, Gina Davis. <laughs> yeah, with this third-party bolt coming up. Yeah. yeah. Oh, let's, my God. Let's root for the cliff again. What? Why couldn't it be no, Susan? No, that's not fair to, to Gina Davis. I know. Gina Davis is, is Lovely. an unfortunate Lovely. casualty right. in that film. She's collateral damage, of yes. which we had none yesterday. Exactly. No civilian... Oh, my God. Will anybody give Biden credit for no. anything? No. All right. Well, thank you for preemptively well, answering Brian that. Brian Kilmeade said, uh, give Biden a little bit of credit, but his withdrawal from Afghanistan soon. was disastrous. Is his oh, contract up for is his contract up for renewal? Oh, my God. Be fired. It was the most <laughs> successful evacuation in history yes. out yes. of Afghanistan. Yes. I will say it again, Jody. Really? Did we think it was going to look like Martha's Vineyard Airport? Like, really? It was going to be a little messy. And this was Trump's, oh my God, and he's just such a traitor. He's such a traitor every single day. What does Martha's Vineyard uh, Airport look like? I, it's, it's very, very quaint. small and very quaint, and everybody's very orderly and polite. <laughs> I figure it's like in that show Wings. It's yes. like Aisha Tyler said about when we played uh, Santa, Fe, Santa Fe, Sexy Liberal. Oh. Santa Fe Airport, adorable. A little adobe, a lot of turquoise. They, they give you pie when you land, your bag's on like a... I don't know, a coffee table. The Martha Vineyard one, you probably have to give your weight, though, before getting on the Yeah, because there are small planes that fly into there. <laughs> it's a lot of fat shaming. In no, no, no. It's Trust me, because when, yeah. when I lived on, on uh, the Big Island, we would fly back and forth to my parents on Maui. We, it was twin-engine right. Cessnas. So right. nine seat, you literally had to tell the pilot yeah. how much you weighed, right. or you could crash the plane. I remember uh, I did, we did a trip my uh, you know girlfriend at the time. It was a long time ago. Anyway... <laughs> We did a trip to Alaska, but it was right after JFK Jr. Oh, I remember oh, that. My. Right, yes. and we were going to Glacier Bay, mm -hmm. and we went on the tar. I'm like, we're getting in that plane that was like this. 
That's actual size. This big was this big. I'm I like, like I'm small getting plane. in that plane. I, prefer I don't. Them. I don't. I nope. prefer. Didn't your girlfriend want to want to pet a bear on that? No, no that was me. Do that. Oh, that, that was, was you. Me. You. Oh. I wanted her to get my picture. Okay. Get my picture with the bear. That's. Dumb. Bear, yeah, really no, no. Oh, bear. There's... She would have been yelling, "Bear, let go of Stephanie!" Bear, there's so no. Many, there's so many reasons. It's amazing I'm alive today. I know. <laughs> we're talking about the stupid <laughs> we did when we were young, like oh yeah, I before mean, there was Google or cell phones. Yeah, yeah. I got in the car with two Italian guys, my friend and I, and uh, we were in college. Oh, you don't want to know what I? We did. were like, yes, we would love to have a tour of Rome by night. Yes. Oh, in Italy. Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, we just got in the car. We just got in the car. We're like, yay, Rome by night. Been there, done that. Sort Amazing of Amazing I'm alive. Same. Stupidest woman in the world. Dumb. Glad was, there weren't What was your phones. dumbest thing? Uh, trying to get into a friend's building in Hawaii and the security door was clo- was yeah. locked and yeah. I didn't have the key to that. Yeah. So. And he wasn't home. And so where I, I went up and I could jump down and it was a walkway that was two stories above. So it was a very, th- and I jumped, I made it. But wow. what was I thinking? I was 17. Yeah. What the hell was I thinking? Uh, your bones <laughs> bend at that think, age. They you, didn't break. Right. You bounce. <laughs> yeah. You bounce. Bumbles, bumbles and teenagers bounce. Yeah. <laughs> it was just like the dumbest thing in the world to have done. Because I could have killed myself yeah. easily. Right. That was our years of, I am a golden god. Yeah. yeah. Jump into the pool. It was, you know, like three right. people wide the walkway, too. It wasn't even like a huge, you know. <laughs> I've been held thing. at gunpoint, and I don't think I've ever been as close to death as you two have. <laughs> mm. Have you ever had I've handcuffs thrown on you? No. My God, you yeah. were like a goody-goody, held- goody, weren't you? I no. got held up at gunpoint. Uh, totally Did good you? Good. I had a pizza on my lap, and I was like, oh, here's my pizza. Please don't kill me. That worked, though. It worked. Pizza. You have a friend to have of mine almost got carjacked one time, and she was yeah. in a really, really horrific mood. And this guy comes up to her with a gun, and she looked at him, and she said, not today. And he walked away. He was like, I'm not even going to try. <laughs> not today. Not today, Satan. Not today. Oh, 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 <laughs> oh, wait. I meant this. Not today. It was. It was real that. See, if I had my sound box with me, I would just play this. Not today. <laughs> Are you feeling lucky, punk? <laughs> exactly. That was the look on her face, apparently. Yeah, oh, I remember I didn't have any money, and so I was looking at my glove compartment, but because I was a prop comic. I, you were, yeah. So I had you like a, a chicken? Rubber shark. And I did. I had like a rubber shark and all kinds. I was like, oh, In I don't know. your glove compartment? Yeah. I don't know why. I just carried like You props. never know. It's like, it's like, let's make a deal. Do you right. have this? Yeah. <laughs> it was like, you know, I had a slide whistle. And I was like, oh, <laughs> naturally. A glockenspiel. Right. Yeah, I grouch a grouch spiel. I grouch like glasses, <laughs> whoopee cushion, rubber shark. What? what can I trade for my life? An arrow you can put on your head. Yeah, <laughs> those giant sunglasses. <laughs> oh what, what, what did he take? That they put on little kids. Exactly. What, what finally got you free is what I, I want to know. I think it was the pizza and just my general <laughs> spaziness <laughs> that he felt <laughs> sorry for me. <laughs> hey, lady, <laughs> about that rubber shark. He probably dumped a whole pizza full of molten cheese on his face. <laughs> That's how he got away. <laughs> ow, ow, ow. Uh, okay. <laughs> oh, anyway. That was a diversion. Hey, <laughs> back to, to Biden killing terrorists. <laughs> T-Pain tweets, Biden kills terrorists. Trump plays golf with them. Yeah. What are the chances? He's just such a traitor. Yes. Always to yes. the United States of America. He's right playing with, the, oh my God. The people behind 9-11 saying, oh, I don't think we really got to the bottom of 9-11. It's like, what? Oh my God. Yes, we have. Not only to get to the bottom of it, Biden had the coordinates. He's just right. He sides with Russia on mm-hmm. Brittany Griner yeah. two days ago. Yeah. Right. Uh, I don't, you know, she's spoiled. I don't know. All drugged up. It's like he just believes whatever Putin says over the United States of America. Yep. Oh, my God. He's a, he told us he's a traitor, Jody. He did. He t- I remember that. <laughs> I remember. Okay. He was he was. Very I good. am a traitor. Thank you. Lock him up. Lock him up. Okay, so the first January 6th terrorist got sentenced to seven uh-huh. and a half years. Right. I agree with his daughters yes. who said Trump belongs in prison for life. Yep. If my dad belongs in prison for... Right. Whatever. Throw the book at all of them. Seven years, that's a good sentence. Seven and a half, yeah. It, um, what you call it? The uh, DOJ asked for like 15, but I, it's a serious enough message yeah. that we have yeah. to start It's not like it's six this. months or two months right. or, you know... Right. Right, but the, his daughters are right. Trump along because he absolutely. is absolutely the the ringleader. None absolutely. of those people would have been there without right. him they inciting them and directing exactly. them. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. He's the Manson, the whatever you want to. He's Charlie Manson oh, who got the, bin, the death penalty. The Bin Laden. The L. Yeah. Oh, by the way, how on brand is this? Hold on. I knew. Oh my God. I just you just things that you know to be true even before they're reported. Trump never wanted to take out uh, Al Zawahiri because he didn't recognize his name. Not a big enough name. Let's see the re- like he's casting 
Celebrity Apprentice. Like, this is available. I, what? Who else is available? <laughs> What's on the list? Oh, my God. Yeah. Uh, maybe because he couldn't pronounce his Every yeah, that... single thing is just about <laughs> him. It's insane. He had the opportunity to take out Swahiri, but he didn't recognize his name. He uh, was briefed many times about the most worrisome terrorist threats, specifically mentioning al-Zawahiri. Trump, quote, was more interested in young and less influential figures farther down the list because he recognized the name. He would say, I've never heard any of these people. What about Hamza bin Laden? (laughs) That's like, uh, who's, which Marx brother is Hamza? I don't, it's. Zeppo. Right? That's Zeppo. Bin Laden had how many children? Oh, for God's sake. 11 billion. A a, a Pentagon official said that was the only name he knew. Oh my God. Well, and I don't think he could pronounce Swahiri. That's true. I don't think he could pronounce Swahiri's name. No. That was it. Yes. I never stopped him. He still wouldn't have done it because he couldn't pronounce. He can't say yesterday. (laughs) Okay. I just, I can't. I literally. As Noel Kessler said yesterday. Um, Trump has problems with uh, uh, words three syllable with, words. words with more than two syllables. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Because of being hopped up on crushed Adderall, it's the and only goofball. way he could read and any goofballs. and goofballs. <laughs> Huff, hopped yes. up on the goofballs. Oh my God, for America. Okay, so that yeah, was that all we do. We have any any further thoughts on that, Jody, on what happened? I just I feel like it does. It, will anybody? Vindicate Joe Biden was exactly correct on Afghanistan, and I just never understood the coverage of the most successful evacuation in history and getting us out of our longest war, which the vast majority of Americans wanted. I, I don't watch yesterday's Tucker Carlson then. Yeah. Oh, they it. had one guy. That, oh, they just had a conspiracy theorist on one of the shows, right? That said, do we like, really know it was him? Do we really know we killed him? I'm like, people said that about bin Laden too. Remember? Oh, right. Yeah, sure. You buried him on the sea. Remember that? Okay. That's it. That's all they've got is maybe it wasn't. I think other yeah. outlet. I think other countries have verified, have verified yes. this. That yes, it's true. Yeah. So okay. That. Did I start the segment by saying Republicans suck yes. at national security? They do. they do. They still do. They do. End of story. Yeah. Right. It's and they're anti-cop. They keep defunding yep. yes. the police. Yes. All right. They don't yeah. like our veterans. They d- they hate our they veterans. They hate the veterans. Oh my god. We yes, want our veterans you. perpetually sick. Yeah. Thank you. Are they going to vote to help veterans with the cancer Senate today? might or do it. Maybe they unless might. they get cranky. Is Susan Collins still cranky? Oh, my God. We're not yeah. getting gay married. You know who it all comes down to, Chris. Who? Quirky. Oh, Eccentric. It does. Maverick. Western Maverick. Fashion bug. Fashion bug. <laughs> <laughs> What's she going to do? Do you think she'll lose the attention a little bit? <laughs> She's going to up everything? We can get eight senators, people. Let's do this. Let's do this. I think she's okay. looking at the new fall denim collection for something to wear when she makes her The acid wash denim collection. Yes, yes. acid washed. Absolutely. Yeah. Yes, jeans. She really, really? Couldn't, shouldn't she have been thrown out of the Senate when she wore a denim vest to preside? Just for the that alone. Just for that. Quirky. Quirky. Eccentric. Exciting. I've got a ring that says F-U on it. She has orange colored glasses. That's quirky. That's eccentric. I came out of the White House looking like a circus tent. Look at me. <gasps> Look at me. Oh, the circus dress. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's fashion bug. Oh, <laughs> these are choices. That one. <laughs> these are choices.